In this video, we will learn how to find out price elasticity of supply. Price elasticity of here we have a question. Let us suppose at rupees 10. This one is initial price. Quantity supplied is 30 unit. This one is initial quantity or initial supplied. When price increases to rupees 15, this one is new price. Quantity supplied increases to 30. This one is new supply. Find out the price elasticity of supply. So here initial price p is equal to rupees 10 rupees 10 is here and new price is 15 so new price which is denoted by p1 is equal to rupees 15 now we have to find out change in price change in price which is denoted by del p is equal to p1 minus p p1 is equal to 15 minus 10 is equal to rupees 5 after that uh, initial supply how much yet when rupees 10 then initial supply is uh, 30 units and when the price increase at rupees 15 then quantity supplied increases to 45 so this one is new supply initial supply 30 units new supply 45 units so we have to write here initial quantity supply or initial supply you can write down which is denoted by del q is equal to 30 units and new supply is equal to how much here new supply which is sorry here q only new supply q1 is equal to 45 units now uh, we have to find out change in supply change in supply which is denoted by del q and the formula is q1 minus q q1 is equal to 45 here so we have to write 45 minus 30 is equal to 15 now we have to fi find out price elasticity of supply so we have to use formula we know that es is equal to del q by del p into p by q price elasticity supply is denoted by es and the formula is del q by del p and p by q del q is equal to we have here 15 and del p is equal to we have 5 so 5 we have to write down p initial price is rupees 10 so we have to write down 10 and initial quantity q is equal to 30 now we have to divide this 15 2 are 30 okay 2 5 are 10 5 5 cancel is equal to 1 so Yes, price elasticity of supply is equal to 1. So, hope you understand this problem related with price elasticity of supply which is taken from class 11 uh, economics book chapter 3 elasticity of supply and demand. Uh, if you understand, please hit the like button and if you are new on the channel, please consider subscribe and do not forget to hit the bell button so you will get the notification of upcoming videos and do not forget to share with your friends too. Thanks for watching till last. Keep supporting this channel. 